stick is the others now I'm here, but I'm not bothered. Hey, so that there's some fish here. Feels another absolute monster. Right. <laughs> it's a breeze. I thought it was an F4, but it's a breeze. Oh, yes, there we go. I'm Look at that. Look at breeze. Right, uh, what we're going to do today, I have uh, hooked up with my good friend Alan, well he hasn't been my uh, good friend over recent... Uh... Oh come on Dave, it's been three weeks! I only nicked a bit of a snap. Listen, but... nicking someone's snap is prison rules where I come from. Listen, there were loads of snap in there to last two people a couple of days and I didn't think you'd miss a steak. You might have missed the steak slicer too. Thanks. And I did apologise. Yeah, all right. All right. But but when you nick someone's steak slice, that's that's fighting talk from from round our end, isn't it? Come on. <laughs> so what we're going to do today is I have challenged Alan Norris, the mightiest fisherman of them all, uh, to a well. We're going to do three different challenges, aren't we? All in one. So we have got, ladies and gentlemen, an eating competition. I <laughs> Alan Norrish's surprise competition. And then we have a catch the fastest fish on a method feeder competition. How fast does so it have to swim? swim? Well, sorry? How fast does it have to swim? Uh, uh, no idea. I threw you that, didn't it? Yeah, I don't know what you're on about. Whoever catches one, the Why, what did I say? The fastest fish. Fastest fish? <laughs> oh right, yeah. Yeah, he's a funny f***er, <laughs> isn't he? <laughs> uh, right, yes, yeah, so we're going to do that. Thanks for that, Alan. Yeah, no probs. And uh, best man win. So, uh, oh yes. Think. There we go. We'll see you at the eating competition. Really looking forward to it. Do something different, and I've challenged him to an eating competition. It's a bit unfair, though, Dave, isn't it? Don't you think? Why? I mean, what? what? You calling me fat already? No, I never said that. Uh, what is that? Right. Is so it? this is Scooby Snack. <coughs> well, maybe for you. This is a land, air, and sea burger from McDonald's, which you have to create yourself. Which is a Big Mac. <laughs> Big Mac. McChicken sandwich and a fillet of fish. Now it's called land, air and sea. It's something to do in America which means land is the beef, sea is the fish and air is the bird. I know chickens don't fly, do they? Well, if you chuck them up, they don't go, go, don't they? But so, no, they don't. No, they don't fly, do they? But it's an American thing and we thought anyone can catch a fish, can't they? You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take the mightiest to my domain. He's at it. I don't even know where so, to start, Dave. I mean... How am I going to get my gob round that? Well, you've had your gob round a few <laughs> things, but uh, <laughs> I'm sure you'll be all right with that. I'm looking forward to it, Dave. Are we mates after this, or what? Are you, are we, are you well, I don't, I don't know, you know. Up? Depends what happens, Alan, really, doesn't it? He's been mourned you for far. He holds a grudge like nobody else, I'll tell you now. Yeah. He's not even been answering his phone. Tell him no. <laughs> right, so the challenge is, we've got to eat this bad boy, and uh, whoever eats it first is the winner. And what's this? Well, that's just, you know, we've got a drink here just to wet the whistle. I know you've got a nice, healthy orange drink. Uh, we've got a bit of barbecue sauce just in case it gets a bit... Uh... But I mean, if you're wondering why I'm asking what these questions, uh, what, what all this food is, I don't eat McDonald's, Burger King's or Kentucky's. I just don't, I just don't eat them. You're not my sort of man then, are you? Fish and chips and the Ruby Murray. Oh, right. yeah. Fish and chips. Rubies. 
Um, but I'll take it, it on, Have Dave. you never had a McDonald's before, then? I can't remember. I've had a Burger King and I've had a Kentucky, but I don't think... I've never had a dog like that. That's well, just... here we go. You're about to. Right. And do we dip these or do we... You can do what you want with it. Do, do what you want. It's lovely. Lovely that. So. We best get this eaten before the uh, flies come, don't we? Yeah, we're going to get in. Right, there. let the challenge begin. Best man wins. I'm up for it, folks. I'm up for it. Let's go. How to are you going to eat yours? I don't know. Can you take it apart? Do what you want, mate. I think I'm just going to go in. You mess about here, do you? Mm. That's nice. You eat these all the time, then? You don't have any nose. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, stop putting me off, Alan. God. I'm not putting you off. Um, no, I don't eat these all. This is the first time I've ever had one of these. I've got dessert and all for after. It's like some swallowing, is this? Dessert? Mmm. What do you got for dessert? I'll show you when we're finished. I thought you said you couldn't eat fast. Ah, this is just normal. My God. Normal, this. Jaws. Should have brought some napkins, shouldn't I? Have to use the bag. Tell me you've done that before. Mm, not bad, actually. Not bad. First time ever. And then what we're doing after this? Mm -hmm. You've got another challenge on you. Oh. You could have taken Mark Price on instead of me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Price, he'll hate you. <laughs> Sorry, Mark. I've all on here, though, haven't I? You think that'd actually take Mark Price on? No. Has come down a lot faster than mine. I don't know about that fish on top. I can't tell what's what. Are you eating salad as well, or? Oh, aye. You're not dodging. Love a bit of salad. <sighs> Gotta watch the figure, ain't you? You want an elm though, would you? <laughs> Is my chair alright? <laughs> Why? What do you mean? Not, oh. not bracket. Well, I'm just making sure it's a party alright. Well, I'll tell you what, folks. Hot tickets and getting down there. Look at that. No chance. Too much talking. I've seen you when you when you're fishing them videos. Be too much talking and not fishing. I like talking. I can't talk with my mouth full, can I? No, it's, it's smashed me up. Not there, yeah. Can you drop some? No. No way you can eat it that fast, man. Oh, no. yeah. I've no chance of that. Oh, good one. Yeah. Last bite. I'm going to dip it in some barbecue sauce. Oh. Well done, Dave. Can I check with time?
Have you done that? Just. Not only has he smashed me up with that, he's demolished a box of chips as well. We're proper hungry. But I have got a dessert. Have you? Mm. Oh yeah, you said. I'll just swill that loaf of bread down me. Right. Whoever finishes this first. Oh my god. What? It's chocolate. Dare you. Dare you. I've just really enjoyed that. What? You've got to. I've eaten some I've never eaten before. Oh my god. He's got to try a bounty, folks, hasn't he? He's slagged it off, you know. What have you done to me? So, Dave. Yeah, but I feel sick just. You will feel at sick eating, it, eating that lot. That oh, time. God. Come on, Dave. It's got, you've got to try it. You've just got to. It's chocolate. I'm not having it. You hate these as much as what you say you do. There's coconut in the middle. <laughs> Bombs away, folks. Go on. <coughs> Put it down, yeah. Mmm, lovely day. Mmm. <laughs> you like it? No. I can Mmm. <coughs> right, it's just finished the meal off lovely that Dave. A bit of chocolate. Uh. <sighs> Cheers. Mmm, <laughs> lovely jubbly. Uh. So come on, tell me the challenge with the fishing. Now we've got to catch a fish. How are we catching them? We're not doing anything now. I'm going to be sinking, boss. <laughs> um, <coughs> excuse me. After I can talk after that bloody bounty, we are going to. Did you win the bounty challenge? Smash you on that one. Yeah, you won the bounty challenge. So I won the big man. I won the land, air, and sea burger. McDonald's challenge, you won the bounty challenge, which you would do, wouldn't you? Because I hate bounties. <sighs> Cheers. Anybody know that I absolutely despise bounties and I can't believe I've ate one <laughs> and I feel sick. They're not that bad. They are. What? Never again, Alan <laughs> Norwich. You stitched me right up there. I thought you were going to bring a right nice cake or a, you know, a Bakewell tart or summer bloody lovely and you brought... One of my favourites, bounties. Your estimation is going down and further down by the minute. Now, we've got to catch a fish on a method rod. I haven't brought my ref method rod, but I'm just gonna... Even though everything's shallow. <sighs> well, time is, the time is nine, isn't it? Time is nine. Nine? <laughs> nine? <laughs> uh, time is nine. We're gonna, yeah, so we're gonna whip a method rod up, bit of ground bait, and yep. we're gonna fish exactly the same. You've got to fish exactly the same as what I'm fishing, same ground bait mix and the same wafter. One of my hook lengths, and then we'll. Uh, it was round up, but no, 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 same. Got to be the same, Alan. Uh, we've got to chuck it out, you can throw it wherever you want, though. No, oh, thank you. One sided again, folks, have you noticed? One sided. Alright, do what you want, Alan. Thank you, that'll do. But, uh, my own up lens. Right, this is the decider. Whoever wins this, wins the uh, Goblet of Truth. 
the mightiest <laughs> keep on bagging trophy of them all. Um, yeah, so we're going to do that and yep. then we'll get set up and uh, we'll go from there. Alright, I'm ready. I'm Let's ready go. For, ready for this one, folks. Come on. Right, ladies and gents, I ain't got a method rod, but I've been having to go on Waggler earlier on, and I've, uh, because the mightiest thinks he's the mightiest method man there is, we're uh, fishing on a method feeder, and uh, I've just got myself a, a rod, put a method feeder on, there you go, but he's got some secret stuff, which I'm quite worried about. <laughs> Are we all rolling? God, he's, he's never read it. Come on, first one to catch one. Are you ready? God, he's so slow. No wonder your last loves you. <laughs> right, we're in. Time. We're in. Right, gotta catch one. I know what he's gonna do, he's gonna go down edge. Listen, I've got to uh, uh. waggler on here. It's gone in, it caught my finger that. First one to get one on the feeder. First one to catch one on the feeder. I can't let I can't let Woody beat me, can I? He's demolished. I can't believe how fast he demolished that. He's moaning now. He's moaning about the fish not being really over clever. He did eat it too fast, he's got indigestion I think. Blaming it on the bounty. I'm not having that. Oh yeah, oh he's chucking pellets in edge, he's chucking pellets in edge. Oh I tell you, I'm gonna chuck some edge. I'm gonna chuck some casters in my edge down here. I feel you that <laughs> Just in case, we have to have another chuck. Yeah. I've been having some lovely fish as well, fishing shallow, caster shallow, but some lovely hide. Really like light gear on, and I've ended up with a seven pound common carp as well. Apparently, there's not many of them in, but I managed to snare one. Come on, tip. It's longer than I wanted this. It has to be in the net as well, though. No, oh, I've had one on and it's come on. He's changing rules all the time. Changing rules all the time. I think he's going to be my mate after this now. It's a monk on with me for about three weeks. No need to be a monk on, is there? No need at all. Come on. One apiece. Let's make it 2-1 two, two to the mighty fisherman. Come on. It's getting a bit chilly, and oh, A few mozzies knocking about. Brilliant, you can't beat it. My wife just texts me and all, <laughs> don't want any tea. Goodness me, after that thing. That really just a great tower, that one, it's a bit unfair. I don't eat McDonald's. Obviously, David does. Any signs yet, Dave? Got a liner. No, no. Come on, Tip. I can't 
can't tell you, but I've got. <laughs> You're not. To, these are actually. These are. Uh, aren't even out yet. I've already pinched some. Oh, liner, Dave. Liner. What? Come on. Come on. It's gonna go. You are. No. It. It. It was thinking about it. Well, I can't tell him, actually. looks like a 15-ounce Oh, yeah. He's using his waggler rod. <laughs> yeah, but that'll, he'll just be able to brag even more if he gets one first, won't he? Come on. Come on, my little bit. Oh, oh. I think these are small fish having a go, mate. Drop back, drop back. Absolute biggest, biggest drop back you've ever seen. That. God, you know what? I'm gonna get it in there. Just got a feeling that I can nick one. Right, do little bits of ground mating. Come on. Come on, Tip. Oh, Dave. Oh, oh what a massive line of that. Going back out, it's going back out. Oh, a bit high that. Same spot though, same spot, same spot. Just got it a little bit higher than I like. I don't like it to fall down that far. But it's in exactly. Oh, oh, I had a liner then. I think something went for it straight away then, Dave, with ground bait. Sure it did. That is. That is twitching. Come on, go around, baby. I'm going back out. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, Aunt Waggler Rod. Never. It's uh, not in me yet, net yet. It's, a, it's, an, it's an iddy as well, isn't it? What? It's an id. Id? Damn it. Oh, it's one of them skimmers. What fight like women? Hell on earth. Yeah! Yes! Who is the mightiest now? Goodbye, Mr. Norris. Oh, you see how we come up then? Winning fish. Thank you very much. Nanite. That's put him to bed with slippers and a pipe. That's another challenge video done, and I've absolutely smashed him to pieces. Don't believe it. Don't believe it. Good night, everybody. Elvis has left the building. <laughs> he's not, he thinks he's funny, but he ain't. Right, see you later, folks. Oh, damn it. Right, so, uh, 
We've now finished and uh, I am smiling like a Jesher cat. It's not Cheshire funny. Cat. It's not funny. Because uh, I won the eating competition. <laughs> and. Obviously. And the fishing competition. Obviously. No. You were copying what I did. No. No. But he did. He did. Uh, and uh, your little. You, you threw me off, didn't you, there, with that silly little bouncer, which I uh, I ate, yeah. and I feel sick now, actually. No, I think you did well there, Dave. I think it's the fish that uh, that's making you feel bad. I don't think it's bounty. Right. Well, I, uh, yeah, didn't feel well after that. Thanks for that, Alan. No, no problem. No problem. Uh, no. So, at the end of the day, what's it feel like to be beaten by the mightiest fish? Does that mean I can be called the mightiest fisherman ever now, since no. I beat the mightiest? No, just bag up. Oh. I'm the mightiest. <laughs> you actually made that up, mightiest. It's it's mighty fisherman. You you just oh, call me it. you just call me mightiest. Oh right, so, so oh, right. I am the mightiest. Even Oliver Scothorn called me the mightiest the other day. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's caught on, hasn't it? <laughs> um, yeah. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. A bit of fun. Bit of fun. And uh, Elvis has left the building. I wouldn't, mind, I wouldn't mind doing another one actually. Alright, yeah. So we'll see what you folks think. If you want us to do another challenge, we shall be up there, won't we? Oh, what do you mean? We, we shall see. You were going to go into Mightiest then, weren't you? Yeah. You were going to talk Mighty. I will talk. Listen, this is Bag Up TV and we say keep on bagging round here. Alright. Keep, just remember that. Do you want me to say it? Uh, you can do it at the yeah, end, yeah. 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 Right, so if you enjoyed this video, uh, thanks very much, Alan, for uh, taking part. And thank you very much for inviting me. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, the, uh, yeah, as, as Alan said, we'll see what the next video brings. If you'd like to see any more, comment below. Let us know if you find it funny or not, because uh, we certainly had a good laugh doing it, didn't we? Did. And we've got some lovely, lovely fish as well, haven't we? Oh, yeah. Cracking place, this, isn't it? Yeah, lovely place. So thanks for inviting me down. Yeah. Not very happy that I've lost. No, you're welcome. Damn it. Uh, yes, a very well run by the uh, Chapel Town and District, yeah. Jeff and Dave, uh, doing a great here job. at Newbegin. So, uh, They're in the way, isn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, the place yeah. They're doing uh, top job. They're doing all sorts, aren't they, while we're uh, we're doing this filming. So anyway, uh, make sure you subscribe, hit the join button, big up all the members, and we'll see you soon. Thumbs up. No. And keep on bagging. Correct. Do that bit again. <laughs> and we will see you soon. Keep on bagging. Correct. <laughs> Good morning fisher people, I'm Alan Norris from Fish on TV and this is David Wood from Back Up TV. Oh, thank you Alan, thank you. <laughs> there you go. Right, today it is a challenge match, you've been asking for loads of challenge matches from, from us since we last did the one at New Biggin Pond was it? Mm. Where Dave smashed me up didn't you pal? Yeah I took you to my local didn't I and smashed you up with the eating competition, the bounty competition and the fishing competition as well, Alan. Yeah, I was going to say a bit one-sided that, but you also smashed me at fishing and all, didn't you? Yeah. I think all three, really. Yeah. You just swear? No. All right. Says, no swearing. Says, damn no. it, no swearing on this channel. No <laughs> swearing. Right. So, right. go on then. <laughs> you do it, you do it. Today's challenge is... Right, so, we're at Lindholm Lakes. Have you said that already? No, no. All oh, right, we're at Lindholm Lakes, the fantastic complex. We just had a lovely breakfast. In fact, Alan has just brought me a lovely breakfast, haven't you? So thanks very much for that. I did, I. I forgot about all that. Mind you, he did buy me fish and chips after that fantastic match that we fished in the UK Champs at the uh, Decoy Lakes. Yeah, yeah. Great, I, that wasn't it, Dave? I didn't like the fish, so that's why I give it Alan. <laughs> I bought two of them, I thought, ooh, I'm right hungry, I'll buy two, and then I thought, no, I'll give him one, it's crap. Oh, so you didn't think about it, you just <laughs> loused it off. Nice one, Dave. <laughs> so, uh, yes, we're going to do, today we're going to do something different, we're going to do a five, but you can't, basically it's under five pound, and you have to go to the supermarket and buy whatever you want Apart from sweet corn, luncheon meat, bread bread, and stuff like that, so none of those baits, but £5 in a supermarket, buy what you want and we've got to fish with it, basically. So we're doing the £5 supermarket challenge, aren't we? we That's what it's we called. Are. Did you only manage to spend five quid? Uh, no, I was under £5. What other goodies did you buy? Uh, I controlled myself and didn't buy anything. No snack attack? No, nothing. That was good, weren't it, I mean? I'm impressed. 
So uh, after that last one, I got a lot, quite a few comments saying, "Dave, you're uh, looking a bit larger on that." Uh, <laughs> after the double Big Mac, what were it? What did we have? Oh, Lancy and Air. Yeah, Lancy and Air Burger. So uh, I thought, honourable. I've controlled myself today, and uh, no stack attack. So, Alan, what uh, what we're going to do with the pegs then? Tell us. Well, shall we have? I've got it. Oh, have you got it? Oh, yeah. now very well prepared, Dave. Better than your hook tying. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Never preps any oak. No, I don't. So this is heads and the point, which which she ranks best peg. I don't know. That. Well, we're on Willows, aren't we? Willows we're on pond, yeah. Willows Lake, and we've got we've got two pegs on the point, haven't we? So we've yeah. got this one here behind us, and this one. I don't know what numbers they are, do you? Let's have a look. Two techs. I swear, push him in. No numbers. No numbers. Can't see it. I don't know. Don't know what numbers it is. Mm. But we're on the we're on the point on willows, yeah. and what we're going to do is we're going to flip for it. So what do you say? Heads for this one. Heads closer. for this one near closest to us. Tails, Tails for, for the one. point. Right. Are you ready? Shall I do all the honours? Yeah. So you need to call one, don't you? No. It, uh, well, no. I'm going first. So whatever it lands on is mine. All oh, right. There you're going to you're going to come a cars in me at no. the. Uh, so whatever it is is mine. So this is yours, yeah. Yeah. Tails. Tails. The point. Best peg, Anna. Oh, I knew you'd say that. It had to be best peg, didn't it? Right, we've got some bait revealing to do, aren't we? Yes. Yeah, so I'm gonna. Re Do you want me to go first, Alan? Is that okay? You can, yeah. Since you you're gonna win it now, you're on the best peg. I might as well go first. Oh at yeah. Summer. We need to know how much you've spent first. Right. Okay. So I went to Sainsbury's this morning, and, and I, I went to Morrison's. Oh, yeah, I'm posher than you, Sainsbury's. Better than Morrison's, isn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah. And uh, I spent three pound ninety-five. Can you believe that? And I bought. I'll just show you my. They're in here. So this is what I bought today. I'll show you one at once. I bought some red kidney beans. No tins on the bank, ladies and gents, but he's let us just use them for today and don't worry, we will be putting them in the bin. So just uh, remind everybody, no tins on the bank, but just for today we're allowed. So I've got some red kidney beans, alright. Pop a carp base. Carp okay. bait. I've got some lovely garden peas. Be nice right. for my fish and chips then, Dave. Right, okay, so that's what I've got for up mates. I've also got can of baked beans, these were cheap these, 3 95 I spent. Now, these two together. Now this is what I'm going to feed oh, with. What you got here? This is what I'm going to feed with and this is cauliflower rice. Now basically it's just cauliflower in it, it absolutely stinks this stuff. Um, so that's what I'm going to feed with, hopefully it doesn't float. Because <laughs> I'll be in trouble if it does. <laughs> that's what I'm going to feed with. And then look at this what I've got for the hook bait. Pomegranates. Excellent. So that's like my hook bait it's as like well. A red sweet corn, that, isn't yeah, it? Like so that. that's good thinking that. So that's that's mine and that I is. spent three pound ninety five Alan. So that's well well within the budget. That's so uh, far better than mine. Well oh, by the way, before we get onto my bait, I wish you could have seen Dave walking down here. <laughs> it's a bit steep down there, so he let his trolley go. I went that's going in that Dave. I've never seen him run before. No, yeah. <laughs> I did that. Did that. Well, it weren't running, it were more trotting, wasn't it? No, you were panicking oh, already. Yeah, I did late, panic a little bit, yeah. Right, I thought I'd spent three ninety five. I've just worked it out. I've spent three pounds ninety three. Very close from Morrison's. So here we go, folks. My first one is butter beans. Oh. So I can either hook one or I can mush it up for a bit of ground bait. It'll create a cloud. That's the theory. I've never oh, used them right. before. Yeah, I'm yeah. just guessing. My next one is chickpeas. Yeah, chickpeas. We all like chickpeas. We're curry. I hope the fish have got vindaloo in mind. But anyway, that's the same thing. We can hook them, we can mush a few up, create a cloud. That's oh. the theory behind that one. Very good, Alan, so far. I've also bought some raspberry turnovers. Whoa! Are you going to hook one of them? You want one, Dave? Well, I've thanks. got one! <laughs> <laughs> we'll be sharing one of them. God. No, I had, to, I had to get that extra. Well done. Were they, were they in with the price or not? No, oh, no, no, oh, that right. was extra, that was extra. Then I've got some... Oh... Mussels. Fishy mussels. The Fishermania champion. Started on mussels, didn't you, Addy? 
<laughs> muscles, you can't fail your muscles, I hope. So that's going on the hook. Chop a little bit up, put it in with the cloudy mash stuff. There you go. That's the theory behind that one. Is that um, it, Ellen? Eh? Is that it? No. I thought you said no cheese. Oh, no, no, you didn't say no cheese. No luncheon no. meat. Oh, no damn luncheon it, meat. Damn it. I've also brought some red Leicester. I love it. If fish don't like it, Nosha does. I'll be having a bit of that and all, I think. Yeah. I'll have, to, I'll have to give you it though, you're not taking it yourself. Right then, so you've seen the baits, we've, uh, we're in the budget, so shall we catch some fish, Alan? We shall try and be the mightiest. <laughs> <laughs> See you in a bit. <laughs> right, so here's all my bait set up. So I've got the corn, flour, rice, corn rice, whatever it is. I put that in a bit of water because it seems to float so that might not be no good I thought that was going to be great but we'll have to see we've got the peas they're nice and huckable we've got the beans we've got the kidney beans and then we've got the pomegranates look pomegranates are lovely to eat aren't they normal so that's what we've got that stinks by the way absolutely stinks so I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Uh, if it floats, it floats. We've had it. But it might have to be that we're just fishing hard stuff. And just... Uh, that's why I've got my pot. So I'm going to be... Maybe fill them up with a few peas or beans or whatever. And then uh, that's it. Uh, I think that's what we're potting. Possibly maybe half of one of them or... I don't know. Maybe a skin of that on her. Maybe a skin would be working. But we're set up. I've got two rigs. I'm going to fish one here. Just down here because it's quite shallow. Um, and there's just one out in front. And if we don't catch anything, then I'll be going longer. Um, so that plan. The mightiest is doing all sorts. If you see him, he's down there. <laughs> He's, Come on. I don't know what he's doing, but he's hiding all his stuff. The future. Oh, God. So, he's taking it very seriously, he's the mightiest, and, uh, you know, I said it's only a bit of a laugh, but bloody hell, he wants to get one back on me, so uh, he's 3-0 <laughs> he's down, isn't he? So. <laughs> so, we're about all set up. Um, Alex says he's going to do a bit of streaming on there, so there might be a little bit of noise, a streaming noise, but hopefully they won't be, it won't interrupt our video. So, I'm all ready. That's what I'm going to be fishing. Ooh, one just jumped there, look. That's what I'm going to be fishing with, and uh, we're going to have to see how it goes. Fingers crossed. Remember, we're only fishing an hour, so we've got an hour to catch whatever we can, put them in a keep net, and then weigh them. The biggest weight wins, so... That's that's where we're going. Noshus forgot to put his keep net in. <laughs> so that's it. Uh, right, we'll see you at the off. Right, I've got. Uh, I'm going to set a timer for an hour. So we've got an hour. And uh, are you ready, Alan? Yeah. Right. So I'm going to set the timer now as an hour. Okay. Okay. Right. We're off. So that will be when it finishes we are off ladies and gents so I'm gonna first of all put my pole cup on what shall we go on that stinks and all I think we'll go on a pee sink all right then put a few peas in there maybe put a bit of that in see if it goes down or not that's what we're going on Alan's filling the edge in I can see him now <laughs> not watching me big well I can't, I'm only telling people what you're doing Alan so we'll chuck a few peas down there. What else we got? That pomegranate sinks. Should have checked this out, shouldn't have before. Yeah. This stuff is no good, it just floats. Well it's on the see it on the bloody surface there. So I'm, what I'm gonna have to do is fish fish pea, aren't I? Pea in this. 
crack a bit of that kidney up I think chuck that down there because I ain't got much not much there anyway we'll chuck a bit of kidney down there and go out on the old pin it's like fishing Trent because that area it is on all floor's going like that, so I might have to uh, Leave it on the P as well. Feels good as well. Yeah. First fish on the P. What do you think it is? Probably. Uh, I would say it's probably an F1. But uh, you never know. Take me time with it because it's. Uh, yes! Look at that! First fish of the day. That nice chunk here. One. One nil, eh? Look at that. Nice one, babe. That's presentation for you, not just chucking a feeder out like uh, like Alan. I have got feelings and I can hear you, you know. Oh sorry, can you? A few more peas in there. Crushed up uh, crush up a few of them. Oh, he's, he's changing already, you see. I know he won't be able to let me have it. Well, let's feed that inch side line. Couple of peas, couple of crushed up kidneys, and a couple of pomegranates. Just got a feeling that these peas are going to be the better bait today, I would have thought, just because they feel a bit softer and they look, you know, I know they're green and what have you, but I'm sure we'll just catch a few. Just, just think that they're the better bait. Flying broom, flying broom. <laughs> oh, this is great fun. Oh, yeah, it's brilliant. <laughs> oh, dear. Did you see that fly out of the water like 100 mile an hour? Flying broom. Right, so I'm just. Oh, my God, it's possibly fun. <laughs> he 
Even the skimmers love it, see? Right, what have I done here? Well, Woody. Right, it's moving like is this float. Woody is bagging. I had a little, I had a quick look in the margin because I put a bit of bait down. I just thought I'll have a quick look because they can be a bit greedy in here. But this is like river fishing. This it's like. A, it's just not right, it's just not holding still. That's no good, that. That's nowhere near where I want it to be, where I've plumbed up. Let me start over here again. Because the aerator's on, into half tramming. Let's see if we can get it to settle where my bait's just gone there. Maybe. Right, there we are, and what I've done, I've put a little bit of that mush in, the butter beans, and I've just put um, a bit of muscle on, a tiny little piece. Because that pace would be no good out there with the way that's moving, it's moving like I'm on a river. And I've bulked everything right down to the bottom. Let's just hope we get a bite. I can't have him hammering me again, but I just cannot keep this still. He's right, I've not had a thing. I've not had a bite. I don't like the presentation of this with that aerator being on, it's just moving too fast. I cannot keep it still. I mean, look at that, I've moved a yard. That's no good. Nice. It's on. Let's move that back because we're only fishing here. Look. Just fishing here, just right, just right there. On end. Might be a bit too close by it really. We'll have to see. God, my hands are sticky as so. old. Beans everywhere, it stinks of cauliflower. But I am up three three up, two skimmers and an F1. But he only needs one carp as the mightiest and uh, you know what he's like, he's a jammy bugger. No, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go back out. Can't waste time on that because if Alan gets one, it, knowing my luck, it'll be a big carp at twelve pound and undo me. So let's go back out on what we were getting them bites on. Let's get back out to what we were doing. Because we were getting a few bites and at least we put in odd fish in there, we? so let's get back out. Alan seems to have gone very quiet 
and he's, uh, I don't think he's enjoying himself now. But like I said, he just needs to stay positive. And keep feeding that down there, because you never know, it's crushed them. Bits up. Two feet. He's into another one, he's into a big one, he's absolutely smashing me. I've just gone for a quick look out there while I change my battery and what have you. <sighs> There's only five minutes left and I, I can't get uh, can't get a bite. So I'm going to have a, another look out there again. I keep seeing this, I don't know what these swirls are, they don't like fish. Can't make out where it is, but it's like circle swirling here. But I can't get a bite. So I'm going to go back out there on float. I've had a few minutes on this without uh, any success. I'm back out on float. So it's my only chance, but he's, me. he's not doing a right good job of this landing. Look, he's been a bit semi-skimmed. Oh, damn it, yeah. Oh, it is and all. It's about four to five pound. I need a miracle. I seem to need a lot of miracles when I'm fishing. Well. I thought the mussel might have got me a fish. There we go. He's put me to bed with that one. No chance of catching up now. Oh, this side. Can't seem to get a thing. Well, I'll try a bit of, a bit of butter bean with me. With me, yeah. Uh, if I can hook it. Big bead on again, and it's just gone again. Feels a bigger fish. This one. It's all about technique, Alan. Uh, yeah. Presentation. When you know, you know. I think I, I've been lazy, I've left her on float on me. Oh, I've got a float with this at all. Got me sent a free float. I give, I give it Alan, eh? Not funny. Got a free float with this one, Alan. Oh, lovely. Be better than that one you're using, I think. Getting a bit cocky, I'll have to just watch what I'm doing here because it's uh, taking a bit. I think this one is a car. Is it starting to rain? Is that just all splashing coming from my pay? Yeah, it feels it. 
I've got, like I said, I've got a free float on this one. Oh, it's a, it's a big F1, I think. I thought it were. I thought it were a cart, but it's a uh, oh, bloody hell! What's this all about? Where's my mate Mark Roger when I need him to net me a fish? Oh, it's a big F1. It's a big F1. Look at that. It's a big F1. Don't tell Nosha. But it's hooked under the belly. There we go. Another fish. And we've got somebody else's tackle round his blooming float now to compete with. What's this all about? God. Look at that. Give that Nosha here, Nosha a free float for you there. Probably the last fish and all. Oh, he's got one. Oh, he's got one. I hope it ain't a big one. Oh, no, I am. What? You know what I say? I've had lucky margins now. I seem to get a tidbit. That's time. Time. Oh, that is time, ladies and gentlemen. It's not even hooked in the mouth. Nosh has got one right at the end. That's it. A fish! Yeah! There you go, Dave. That was it. It wasn't even hooked in the mouth. Right, that is the challenge match over. And um, I'll just let you know how my match went. I had three F1s and two skimmers. Two skimmers, Al. I had. Yeah, well done, Dave. Alan is not happy. What what happened? Come on. What what happened? Well, I plumbed the margin up and it were as deep as anything. So I thought, and it were a margin float, so I thought I'll have a look out there and laziness. It's an F1 venue this. I just thought, well with bigger baits it'll still be alright. I should have put an F1 float and I was getting indications but wrong float, too thick of uh, what do you call bristle. it? Bristle. Too thick of bristle for an F1. Well, I tell you what, I've got some Tony Brooks floats which are absolutely perfect. Thanks, Tony. You've won me this challenge, mate. <laughs> I've got some in my box. I'm going to give. I'm going to give the mightiest a couple. 
and you can use them because well, the no, planter. No, it I've eats got the plenty. Oh, I've right. got plenty of floats. It was laziness. I thought. Oh, right. we'll, we'll, we'll get it. You were chomping a bit as well, weren't you? D mate, I went to the shop and got ourselves a couple of drinks. I would be I, you had all the time in the world. Don't blame me. Ask me where I were up to. <sighs> what? <laughs> you oh. fed that margin, hadn't you? While I went to the shop. <laughs> I actually videoed myself. Uh, Pre-baiting that, I'll, I'll, I'll be naughty, folks. I'll be naughty. So you thinking so about now? Listen, you were <laughs> bad, weren't you? <laughs> yeah. So well, don't you, swear on this oh, channel, sorry. Dave. You were trying to. No wonder I've won and you've not caught all, have you? <laughs> eh? So I've like, I lost a fish, didn't I? But no, if I if I had to be fair, I should have just I should have made you wait five more minutes. I should have put a, an F1 float on, and I reckon them little indications the float would have been under. I've, and that toe as well, I didn't like that toe. It was dragging through everything. Listen, like we've been in the same area, haven't we? We mm. both had to deal with it. Just I've got a better fishing brain than you. That's that's all. <laughs> you know, I've I've bulked my shot up, put some back shot on, overshot it. You know what I mean? Come I was lazy. Come I, on. I, I ran out I ran out of string. And and who would be the lazy one, the fat guy, you know what I mean? And I've I've done him, so. Anyway, Alan, you've lost another challenge. I mean I don't know what I've weighed, but I've had three F1s. We're not going to bother weighing it because you've only caught one skimmer, haven't you? So the and a foul looked it. Yeah, and wrong bait, I think. The the peas I've caught on, the baked beans I've caught on, um, the pomegranates they were they were too soft, so I've just fed them. So maybe that's I brought on a bit. I nice one on cheese. All right, listen, you ain't caught a thing, so shut up. Um. I'm just telling them about my match here, you oh, know. But I'm getting bored, Dave. All oh, right. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> so that was it, really. Baked beans and peas have caught me the fish, and uh, I've had a flying skimmer, and I've had, yeah, I've had two flying skimmers. Then I'll shut up now, oh, Alan, because yeah, yeah, you yeah. look like you're going to wear. Uh, Sang on myself. Well, I don't know, but uh, yeah, poor match by me. Laziness, folks. Laziness. Us. I should have, I should have loused the uh, margin rig off. I did think I'd get a few in that margin, to be honest. But I should have loused it off, shouldn't I? And just gone for F ones. So, that's the end of the video. I hope you've enjoyed this one. Putting the uh, mightiest to, to bed again with pipe and slippers. Nanite, Alan, Nanite. So um, long, farewell, <laughs> sing goodbye. Um, so, I um, hope you've enjoyed this one. Alan, anything to add? Yeah, I'm gonna change that float and uh, prove I can catch it on the baits that I've got. I think it's the baits that you've got. I don't, I think I'll catch if I change that float. Chickpeas, and what else did you have? Beans cheese, or something, cheese. cheese, butter beans, chickpeas. Made a lovely pace, them chickpeas, by the way. Mm. Didn't catch out on it though, did Didn't you? Didn't catch out on it now. So, anyway, we'll leave it there. Okay. Well done. Uh, we're yeah, well done, We're Dave. allowed to do this now, aren't we? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll even give him a hug because he'll be crying in a minute. Oh, so, uh, I'm going I'm I'm to tell my wife on you. <laughs> well. I'm, say no more. I'm not bringing people's wives into it, Alan. So don't forget, folks, I've had a crap day today, but don't forget, folks, if you enjoy these little challenges that we do, we're always trying to think of things to do. I'm sure I can get one or two back on him, but it's his favourite, all these staff challenges, it's, it's his favourite kind of thing. We do like doing them, don't we, Dave? Yeah, it's enjoyable, keeps, isn't keeps it? Keeps you folks entertained. There's always got to be somebody mighty and somebody very semi-skimmed. He's been rather mighty and I've been semi-skimmed. What can we do, Dave? Look at them, Alan. See them guns? Proper guns, them, Dave. Uh, so don't forget, folks, if you do like these videos, let us know. We'll put a few more together for you. And if you do like David's video, because I'm sure this is going to be a damn sight better than mine, don't forget to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell. You'll get all his videos as he uploads them. And the same for Fish on TV. Correct. Thank you very much, Alan. Uh, you finished the video very well there. I'll say no more, shall we? And uh, just just know this. Four, four, ladies and gents, nil. Let's end it there. Four, nil. Keep on bagging. Take care, folks, and fish you on. Previously. 
five pound in a supermarket, buy what you want and we've got to fish with it, basically. So we're doing the five pound supermarket challenge, aren't we? we That's what it's we called. Yeah. Can of baked beans. These were cheap, these. Three ninety five. I spent. Ellen Norris. Yeah, chickpeas. We all like chickpeas, we have curry. I hope the fish have got vindaloo in mind. Versus. Oh, can you believe it? Oh, no! He's in! Oh, my goodness. Can you believe it? On the P as well. D. Take me time with it because it's. Uh... Yes! Look at that! <laughs> First fish of the day. Look at that nice chunky F1. Backup TV 4. Woody is bagging. A lot of little knocks on it. Oh! Flying broom! Flying broom! <laughs> oh, this is great fun. <laughs> Fish on TV. Zero. I'll just let you know how my match went. I had three F1s and two skimmers. Two skimmers, Al. I had? Yeah, well done, Dad. <laughs> Alan is not happy. What, what happened? Come on. What, what I've just know this four four ladies and gents nil good morning fisher people I'm Alan Norris from fish on TV and this is very white talking let's have a look what's now that's rubbing it in folks isn't it I'm not happy about that but it is the truth it's four nil to David it's another challenge match you are joining us at the fantastic Lindome Lakes and we've decided to fish on Loco Pond. The challenge today is, it's alright Dave, I'll do all the talking. The challenge today is, if you lose, your hair is off. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Mm -hmm. And look at this mm -hmm. lot. Look at this lot. Unfortunately, I've not cut it, that's grown, I've grown that for three or four weeks. <laughs> <laughs> right then, um, are you going to take that ridiculous thing off now Dave, or are we going to... Listen, wag daddy, we've got waggler involved today, wag daddy, more like big daddy. He <laughs> <laughs> must have had a big daddy before Dave. Ooh. Ooh. Right, Happy I've had enough of that, I've had enough of that, Alan. Thank that God. That was... <laughs> That was just to uh, make a statement there that uh, <laughs> we're winning it 4-0. But yeah, uh, <laughs> that, uh, so what we're going to do, Alan, we've got a waggler rod and a swing tip rod, haven't we? We've gone old school today, we people. Are. Yeah, Dave, I'll pass you yours. Yeah, thanks very much. There now, this is my dad's old school um, swing tip rod, basically, and this is a... Ernest Stamford, made in Sheffield. We reckon this is, is it fiberglass? We, or? we think it's fiberglass, yeah. It's proper old school, this. Um, I'll give you a close up of this later on, but it's, it's old school, isn't it? And a lovely look at this swing tip on the end. Everybody said, oh, get a swing tip video done. So we thought we'd get a swing tip video swing done, didn't we? And this is all the marbles today. Are you having them sideburns off? No, 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 I've got to keep my wool. Uh, thank you very much, babe. I'm going to keep that going. Oh, God. You know Just in... Now, and my rod, what? unfortunately, I think I told you, I gave all my old gear away to a good course for kids that uh, needed a bit of help and what have you, so I give all my old fishing tackle to... Uh, You're a goodie, um, aren't you? Yeah, to a fishing tackle shop. And, and it was a rod very similar to this. A friend of mine said he got one. It's 40 years old. We think it's probably one of the first carbons. It's a dye. Oh, that's better can't read what it says on there it looks like it's 11 foot because you can't read the writing it's all worn off 
and if you look there there's the swing tip with the special attachments at the bottom we're allowed to fish bomb and waggler today aren't we yes that's what we're doing a four hour match fishing bomb and waggler um you've got to at least go on the method bomb and waggler aren't you for at yeah. least 15 minutes yeah. um now it's quite breezy isn't it on loco it's going to be a test even for the wag dad well you know what do you reckon by the way look at that what? Atta attachment rings we've yeah. both got them up yeah old, old, old school. school i used to stick, stick a bit of tape around there because they used to move yeah 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 they used to stretch a bit so. i remember some people used to have the rod down here do you remember yeah people what couldn't fish yeah <laughs> <I> <laughs> as far as yours ain't down there <laughs> No Yours need. is a bit further, Dad. You should have it at top, shouldn't you? No need for that, day. I've just put it on for demonstration purposes. I'll move it up shortly. Yeah, I bet. So, um, we are going to draw pegs. We are on peg, what is it? Um, 15, 16? No, no. no? That's um, 17 and 18. Right. I think we're going to move up one, aren't we? Yeah. 18 and 19. It's quite busy on here, isn't it? Yeah, Friday. It's busy. Loco, it's, uh, it's a popular pond. Mm. So, we're just going to give ourselves a little bit of space. There's a bit of mad casting going off down there, isn't there? Yeah, someone's spotting in all sorts of crap, aren't they? <laughs> Bloody carpers, eh? Um, <laughs> <laughs> they're all fishermen, Dave. Oh, fishermen. sorry. We're all... no hate from, but somebody's getting their head shaved today. So this is it. Two rod challenge. You've got to use the, the rod, one of each rod, 15 minutes. Four hour match rules, yeah. Norrish. Yeah. Uh, and you've got to film your own match as well. So we've got to do the filming. Like a lot of people have commented and say, oh, do this, do that. But it's hard work, innit, when we've got to film a zone. We ain't got a cameraman. I mean, a river. Can you imagine going down to a river? Well, with, listen, with I was brought up on a river. People don't realise that, uh, you know, river fishing. I did that for like 20. Same with you as well, didn't you? That's all I ever did. <laughs> river I fishing. Did. I don't think I've got any river gear though now. So no, I've got maybe a couple of stick floats left. I've given all my other stuff away. I'll tell you what, next time, Newark Dyke, Trent, Farndon, we're having it on. You're on, you're on. So, yeah, thanks for everybody commenting on the videos um, and giving your opinion and um, letting us know what you think of them. And today, it's going to be again, is it going to be five, nil, or is the nosher going to nosh one in? Can you hear that tune, Dave? You hear it? No. It's coming home. Oh, eh? God. It's not football, Nosher. It's fishing, it's the same thing, it's just as competitive, Dave. All right. Whoa, he's angry today. <laughs> I was late again for the breakfast. Where are you? Where are you? You were hangry, angry, weren't you? Hangry? <laughs> hangry. Oh, well, we're hungry. Yeah, hungry, but angry as well. Hangry. Hangry and hungry. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're going to draw the pegs. So, Alan, what are we going to do? Shall we do the same as last time? Yeah, let's do the same as last time, but I will, I will pick. Okay, so... You picked last time, didn't you? So heads is peg 18. Yep. Um, Tails is this one by the tree, yeah? Right, okay, Are you happy with that there. Yeah. Tails. Yeah. So I've got this one. Is that what we said? <laughs> I can't remember. <laughs> Yeah, it is, isn't it? Heads was that. No, we're it. I can't I show you. Don't, don't even remember. No, no, no. We're going to have to watch it back and see where we're we'll at. We'll watch it back because neither of us can remember. God's sake. <laughs> we need someone a bit, uh, a bit brainy here, aren't what's we? What's a pair of Muppets? Right, we'll leave it there. Let's go oh, see. Oh, by the way. Oh, go on, go on, yeah. go on, go on. Hate choice. It's got to be, hasn't it? Well, Lingo. listen. Fishing the 8 mil pellets. Oh, I've got, got a few secret, secret baits, so... Uh, I'll tell my uh, my fans later. I've left my pellet oil. Any chance I can borrow some of yours? Nope. The bait tech said, ask Dave if you're a bit short. All right, did they? Um, <laughs> not today, Nosha. Not today. Right, let's get cracking. Right, coming on my box now. I think, are you ready, Nosha, then? Right, I'm all set up. We're all ready. 
tend to uh... are you going to look after the time? Nosh is going to look after the time so that'll do me oh, where's that other catapult? Not in there. The one in here. No. Not in there either. Bloody hell. Great. Right, so I'm all ready. I'm waiting for Nosha to ring the L. What? Alright. What time is it now? He's eager. So we're not going to go too far out. Because it's a bit too windy. But. Just go out as far as we can feed these pellets. So I'm now. Bloody hell that wind's getting even worse. I think what I'm going to do is sneakily. Put a few pellets down there I think as well. Good luck, mate. I hope your hair stays on today. Right, so we can get about 20 metres out, 25 metres, because they're not, not bad, these pellets. So what I'm going to do, feed a couple of handfuls, and then I'm going to chuck it out. Swing tip massive. Oh, God. Oh, terrible cast. <laughs> Terrible cast. This rod, this rod. Oh god, you're not like you know finesse with it, but uh, listen, I think what we'll do is I'm not clipping up, but I'm gonna put it to uh, right. My my dad used to fish the swing tip, and he says, Well, there's a few ways of fishing it, and you can have it straight forward and it go up. But he always said, fish to the side a bit. And let's put a few more pellets out. And you'll see the bites more. Not like you won't see them anyway at a carp puddle, would we? This were more when we were bream fishing, when we were smaller. So I'm going to start on this. And then I think... <laughs> good, good cast, Norris. <laughs> he's having, a, he's having a bit of a terrible time casting as well on the old swing tip. They're not like they used to. So anyway, my dad used to say, put it at an angle, and it's, and then you'll see it go sa sideways, upwards, like sort of thing. So that's how I'm having it here today. It's probably a ter well, swing tips just swinging away like. But uh, obviously, you used to fish for bream, didn't you? And you used to fish a swing too. There weren't no really cart waters that used to fish back in there. <laughs> catapults broke. No, I mean, catapults broke. God, we're having a nightmare, aren't we? Well, I thought they'd had that soft pellet. Saying that it weren't a great cast, were it? I'm trying to cast, I should have cast out a little bit further. But I'm sure we'll know when we get a bite. Uh, did it? Is it? He, he's uh, a bomb specialist, his old nosher. Oh, look how happy he is. Oh, God. This is what I've got to put up with, ladies and gentlemen.
<sighs> well, don't don't worry, David. It's only one. I don't think I've found my groove yet. He's a bit of a bomb specialist, is old Nosher. He's got an F1. It's only a bloody small thing. It's only a small thing, ladies and gents. Don't want to worry about it. The hell's he shouting at? He's in his element on the bloody bomb rod, is Nosher. Not found my groove yet with this, so. It's a bit of an update for you. So, I've had a bit of a nightmare. Nosher got one first chuck in there, they were yeah, happy as Larry. And um, he was laughing his head off, oh, here we go, we've got one, yes. All this stuff. Look, he's in the background there. He's, he's not looking happy now. But I've had I've had a carp. So I got one. I got one later on. It were a big carp. I got it to the net, and then it come off. And it must have been about twelve pounds. So thanks very much for that. That come off. I, got, I were a bit angry about that. Then I chucked in again, and it went round again. I got another one. Netted that one. It were about six pounds. So I got that one in the net. But because this rod is just ridiculously. It, there's no giving it at all. When I get it to the net, it just lose the fish. So it's gone round again. Don't get me wrong, I'm having a couple of bites. It's gone round again in the first hour. We're in the, still in the first hour. And I've, I've t t cut a couple of turns on it, and it's just come off again. Um, I've, I've had a problem with my rod. One of the eyes has come off at the top. That's come off. The, the eye on the swing tip, that's come off as well. So it's terrible at the moment. The presentation of this swing tip business is terrible. Uh, I can't cast it in properly. It's going in with a colour dush because I'm trying to... It, it, I'm casting it going do, 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 through eyes and stuff. Oh, it's an absolute nightmare. So at the minute, in the first hour, I'm in front probably by, by about £3, I would have thought, because he's got an F1. It's not big, but I should have had three carp in the net. Um, I ain't seen any F1s. I'm catching carp. They've been carp. They're not being F1s at all. So the first hour ain't going too bad, but it, it is in, in the fact that it's a terrible first hour for me because I should be three up. Um, so I don't know if I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to call this off because if I get another one on it and I lose it, I'm gonna sack that off because I just can't fish it at all. I've not tried the waggler yet, but. I'm gonna have to try the waggler, I think, and I might have to just sit on the waggler and just keep keep trying to catch one on a waggler. But it's terrible conditions for a waggler. So at the minute, it's not going great. Uh, I'm having a bit of a first. Yeah, it's not going well at all. But we'll have to see. Let, let's keep going. We're in the first hour still. Um. Nosha had his tail up first of all when he got that laughing his head off oh this is the greatest thing in the world and I was like oh my god I can't get a bite on bomb anyway he's on suicide watch now he's, he's seen me lost a couple and he's he's a bit worried I think anyway let me crack on see if we'll get another one right I've come off the bomb rod it's uh, like I said it's terrible I've had a tangle in it I've had all sorts in it that's uh, why we don't fish the swing tip no more, is because, oh god, we're in, we're in tree now. <laughs> oh, what a terrible. I think that's why we don't fish the swing tip no more, because it's that bad. We're going to have to have a go on this waggler and give it a go, see what it's like, because I just can't. Well, I've, I've had three on it, don't, don't get me wrong, I've had three fish on that, but... It's just not to uh, get rid of that.
just gonna have to have a go on this and just to get something going here because end up catching out. Oh, that's one. That's one, ladies and gents. Right. Get some bait over. That's one, Nosher. Big carp and all, I think. We don't catch them skimming. We don't catch them red ones, do we? Big carp. Big carp daddies. Take me time with this, I've lost every bloody one. Yeah, it's a bigger fish this. Yeah, I think so. God, it's whistling and all sorts. It's, it's hard work, isn't it, when it's windy and all sorts of stuff. You just... Come on, come on, come on. There's a snag down there. With that other one, when it went down there, it just felt like it was grinding on summit. But this seems to be staying out in the middle. Nosher's found a manta, so... Knew it won't be long. Hopefully his will be a really small F1 or summit. That's it, come on, come on, come on, yes, got it. That'll do once. What a day it is, eh? Bit big that one. Right. That were all right, weren't it? Oh. I'm whinging a bit there. I thought it were going to be terrible, but... Let's see if we can get another one. Carp, not sure. He's coming, he's coming other way in Hartwing. Oh, he's only got an F1. That's alright for me. So he's got two F1s now. He must be fishing six mil pellets or something. I don't know what he's fishing. We've got another one folks, we've got another one. Another waggle went a bit further this time. Feathered it down Richard. And the pellet landed beyond the waggler and instantly, it must have taken it three seconds I'd give it. Not instantly, three seconds. Oh, 
I may take one carp though for, da for Dave to absolutely smash me because it's, it's neck and neck this. But having said that, it's the same for me as well. Oh, I thought we were going to get his head up then. Yeah, putting some decent scraps up these today. We've got him, we've got him, we've got him folks. We've got him, that's one less hair off so far on the barnet. Come on Nosh, come on Nosh, come on Nosh. <laughs> Ooh, so that takes me to another couple of pounder. That takes me to 27 pound. And I think Dave's got similar to that as well. I keep wanting to try me uh, swing tip again with a bit of muscle on because I absolutely emptied it with big carp last time but I'm catching so I can't can I? Can you believe that? And I think it's a unit. Oh, please God. window before. It's atrocious. <laughs> Terrible. Absolutely atrocious. If you can get presentation for a split second, you might get a quick bite like that, and that's it. The scores on the board are, Nosh has pulled a comeback, he's got about, oh no, that wind. Oh, terrible mate, terrible. Nosh has pulled a bit of a comeback. He's, got, he's catching F1s. And he's catching them quite fast. Now, that's a bit of presentation. She was just get a little bit odd bit. 
like a split splitty second the presentation you might get a bite he's got one on now he's not sure you you're in front anyway you are he's sneaking them f1s in all the time so all he does Nosha, sneak, Mr. Sneaky man. So, if you get a little bit of presentation, you can get an F1. And Nosha seems to be doing really well at it. Now, I'm gonna sneak a few in the other net, I think, just to, uh, upset him at the end when we uh, you'll get another one anyway didn't get that one in so that that's all right well for me but absolutely terrible conditions I don't think I've ever ever fished the waggler, and I, I normally won't fish waggler in this. I'd probably I'd probably set a feeder up, and we'd probably start catching on a feeder. But this uh, I can't do what else. Nosh is getting one of chuck F ones, and he's uh, he must be well in front now. Look, my rod's gone. So I reckon he's two in front, Nosha. So I could keep putting these F1s in, I don't mind. I think what it is, you just gotta keep catching. And if I can keep catching, keep putting fuel fish in there, I'm more than happy. But like I said, I think he's in front now. These F1s aren't bad to catch, are they? Oh, get my head sorted. So, I think these F1, if you're not, oh my catapult's broke now. You're not getting that bite on the initial splash, I think it's better to fire in a few and reel in a bit. See if you can sink that line. And see if you can get a bite in a bit closer in. Because this is crazy conditions. Absolutely crazy. But it is what it is. Someone will have their head shaved at the end. And it's starting to rain now. I didn't think there was going to be any rain, but there is. These are strange, strange conditions. It's been sunny as all. Now it's raining. I have to put my big camera away. What a day! That's an F1. God. You 
can't uh, Oh no, it's a car, well, small car. Hey? Small car. Right, we're right at the end now. Two minutes from the off. Nosher has just had one at last cast in. And that's it. What time is it? It's tight time! It's over. It's over. What are you doing? You're not reeling in, Nosher. Alright, you can't put it in net though. Right, so. I've no idea, it's very, very close, this. I think you've done me. I d I I've got a funny feeling I haven't. I don't, I don't, 30, 34, 45 pound? That's what I'm going for, I've used all my blooming pellet. What? 39. 35, what, you've got 39? I, I think I've got 35. Oh my goodness, this is going to be tight. Right, we, what we're going to do now is, he's going to go get the scales from his car, we'll just move a few things out of the way. Listen, well done, well done. Well done mate. Watch my rod. That one nip and took that one, it? That were a good match. Great right? match, that. Like yeah. Like that, right, so we'll, we'll cut it there and we'll, uh, we'll go see what crack is, yeah? God's sake, mate. I can't breathe. I can't think. Right, folks. Oh, we're doing this? It's the weigh-in, isn't it? It's the weigh-in, folks. God. We're looking at two cameras. Yeah. So, Dave, you think he's 35, 36. I think he's more. I have 39 on my clicker. I think this is nip and tuck. I'll go get mine. Right, we'll do it. We're doing noshes first. Noshes. It's all been... I'll just say do it again, because it takes two minutes. This... This is very, very, very. Look at him, he's like a spring bloody chicken. He seems happy enough, does Nosher. He seems very happy. There's more than I thought in there, you little sneaky bugger. In there? No, it's what I think. I think it's about 40 pounds. You just... 39 on my clicker. Oh, God. This is all I need, isn't it? When did you catch all them, Nosha? Hey? Today. <laughs> I'm gutted. There's 42 pound there, easy. Little zero out. You lying sod. Forty-three pounds eighty. Eighty? Yeah, eight zero, yeah. What do you mean eight zero? It does it in one hundred, so it's digital you see. Oh, oh, fair enough, whatever. Forty three eighty. Oh god. Alright, do you want a picture? Yes, please. Oh, god, say it. Thirty-five pound, I think I've got. <laughs> he's, he's very happy with himself, aren't you? How many caps it me? Go on. Well done, Nosh. Thank you, fishy. I think you're more than you. Think. Right, forty-three eight. It was. Well, I want to see you. Uh, I'll do it, don't want no messing. I, I I don't know about these scales. Forty three pound this. Right. Okay. He's talking over there. Forty three pound.
Why is he running it again? Go on, go on, put him down. 43 pounds. Just, uh, I've got six F1s in this one. No, I don't think so. Yeah, well done Dave, you've done me there mate. That's 50 pound. Yes! Get in! Damn it! 57, 28. That's the big isn't it? I don't know. Yeah. What can we I'm a little bit naughty, eh, now with the... I was a little bit naughty saying I had 35 pound, weren't I? Have you enjoyed yourself, Alan? I have. It's been a cracking day, hasn't it? Yeah, it's, it's, been, been, it's been, been really good. good. Really good match. Yeah. Good laugh. You got a bit more when I set a catching though, didn't yeah, you? Very more Because I I was catching quite well. And he went a while with without a fish. You were getting worried, weren't you? I was getting really, really, really worried at one point. Definitely, you reckon I've had more fish? It looked like there were more fish in, didn't it? You've definitely had more fish, haven't you? But I think I've just caught them bigger stamp. And yeah. I don't know how them bigger stamp when we're fishing, same thing. Yeah, I know. But, uh, I think I got two carp in I early on on swing tip. And I, yeah, about fifteen pound I thought they were roughly. You said no, but I've just seen him. He's lying again. They were definitely an eight yeah. pounder and a I, six pounder. I apologise. I don't. I don't normally lie like that. <laughs> but, uh, I just thought I might get into his head a little bit. And and uh, I, it, I tell you what, it's tense. I don't know how people go on in fish or fine. Oh. I'd be absolutely yeah. Uh, it was unreal, wasn't it? Because it was fish for fish right to end. It were it were unbelievable. It were like cast out. Well, you saw you saw some footage of mine casting out into another. David have one I cast out into another David have one but I caught a few while you weren't catching didn't I mm, yeah. but there were only two pounders mm. this stamp of fish I've just looked at the ones that he's had they were definitely bigger fish than where bigger fish weren't they I don't, yeah. I don't know how I've caught the bigger fish either I think we've just been in that area isn't it? yeah I thought as well it's been a little bit more flat calmer in well not flat calm but a bit more calmer here yeah like there you can see, see. the winds blowing down yeah. here and yeah. I think that uh, but anyway, it is time, and someone did. We're going to get the red shirt. I'd grow my hair. Look at all this. I've receded anyway, so I weren't really that bothered. And I need an haircut. But <laughs> Alan needs an haircut, doesn't he? <laughs> so, Alan, if you'd like to take a seat, seat at David I will. Wood's Let me just barber shop. Just put that down there a little bit. There we go. And, uh, you can just take a seat there. Oh, well, no problems, David. Uh, it. Uh, my wife's going to think she's married to a different bloke when she gets in. Right, uh, I'm afraid you're off. <laughs> <laughs> you're bottled anyway, you know. It don't matter, does it? It's only hair, folks. It's only hair. I'm more peeved off I've lost again. <laughs> he doesn't stop talking, does he, while I'm in... Can you imagine him in, uh, in hairdressers? Can you believe it? 5 nil. And anyway, I'm not happy about the bounty thing. I like did... that? Should we leave it like that? No, keep going, Dave. Uh, God, oh. not, uh, not a very good hairdresser, you know. You might have to do that. Right, get it all off. I'll well get it off. Yeah, it's, it's 5 nil up, but I, I didn't even know it was a challenge bounty. He made that one up, didn't you, Dave? <sighs> well, I'll leave you the side burns, Al. Oh, thanks. Have you got a pair of stippers at home? Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. oh, yeah. I, I, just, uh, I can mean it. Don't forget to do it the other side oh, as well. Don't worry, I'm just just gonna just do this bit here because I don't what I don't want to do is get your sideburns and uh... a little a little bit off the sides, big fella. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this is this is crackers, isn't it? What what the hell are we gonna do next, people? <laughs> God what, no. What are we gonna do next? What, what did John Arthur say about me in a mankini? That's never going to happen, is it? No, Let's I, be fair. I can't see you in a mankini. People, people don't want to see that, do they? Not sure. No, I, 
I'm, not, I'm saying I can't see you in a mankini. I won't want to see you, see you in a mankini. I bet John Arthur or Nick Speed would like to be in a mankini, wouldn't yeah, he? Nick Speed's a bit Mi freaky, Yeah, Nick Speed loves, he loves all that stuff. Right, uh, I think we're about to... Uh, Is that it? Are we... Is that it? Not take me long to... Uh, sort I don't feel out. it. That's just... Uh, oh, Dave, I tell you what, I know where to go for my hair cutting, folks. Your lass is going to love you, isn't she? Oh, she's going to think it's great. Let's just uh, get that on the old... I can see you all laughing. No laughing. <laughs> right, folks. Ta da! We <laughs> <laughs> got Look at that, folks. Oh. There's a bloke over there fishing. He's laughing his socks off. Well, to be honest, Alan, I, uh, I tell you what, you don't look bad. You just need to sort them sideburns out a bit. Well, thank you very much. But uh, thanks for being a, a very good sport. And uh, I thought you'd actually done it today. I thought today was your day. I'd, 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 I thought it were close. It were actually a battering, wasn't it? Didn't end you off. What were 57? You were 14. 57 to, pound, I had in 13 or 14 pound more. It said 35. I knew it. I knew it more than that. Yeah, that that were bad on me. I apologise to uh, everybody but, for that. But them fish. When I saw them fish in his the first way in the size of them fish, I needed four fish to the side of them. You lying tow rag. <laughs> well, that's another challenge match. <laughs> well done, Dusted. Uh, comment below what you would like to see next, and uh, I'm sure you'll agree with me with thanking Alan for being a very good sport and having his head shaped. Um, because uh, I'd have been well pissed off. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. No. Not at all. But um, yeah, comment below t to let us know what you uh, would like to see next time. What what do what do we want to do next time? What do you think? What do you fancy? We've got to do something. We've got to keep well, this going, haven't we? We, we have. But, I mean, people keep mentioning sort of reservoirs, canals. We've got to find somewhere. We need to catch some fish to make it. Yeah, entertaining. And entertaining. So the, think of that as well, folks. I know you keep mentioning rivers. Rivers, it's a hike to rivers. We're, we're thinking of maybe what's, where did you mention? Newark, was it? Maybe Newark or Farndon, where you can park behind your peg. Yeah. Right? Or it, Burton Joyce. Yeah, Burton Joyce. It'd have to be a, a bit of a, a big match, wouldn't it? You yeah. know, we'd have to do a proper match and, and stuff like that. So it might not be as entertaining if you're sat in one and we can't yeah. see you or anything yeah, yeah. like that. And, so. and, and you see, the other thing at all, folks, we've got cameras on all that equipment. We haven't got a camera and we do it ourselves. So yeah. and we've got a bit of gear to lug about, haven't we? So, yeah. But anything you can think of, we're up for it. Well, I'm up for it, obviously. Alan's up for anything. Yeah. <laughs> no, so, thoroughly enjoyed that, Dave. The best man won today. The wag daddy, not big daddy. <laughs> Let that be a lesson to you, Alan. Never challenge me at waggler fishing. I'm not having that. That's another challenge, then, isn't it? Another waggler match. Is that what you're saying? Oh my God! Here we go again. You, uh, you're going to need to pull this back, aren't you? Come on. Yeah. What am I? Five nil now. Five nil. I'll tell, tell you what we're going to do, aren't we? We're going to do a quick casting challenge next time. Oh, yeah. So oh, we're going to do a casting it? challenge, so that'll be on as well for you. Yeah. And then... Uh, do I have to feather it down? Oh, God, don't ask my brother. He'll be on your back. <laughs> right. no, man. Uh, but that's it. I'm going to have something to eat and drink now because I'm yeah. bloody starving. I am. I've, uh, I'm shattered been, as well. Yeah, never been so tense in my bloody life. It was tense as well, wasn't it? That? Yeah. Yeah, very good match. That. Take your hats off to them boys in finals when it's nip and tuck. Yeah. Because we were just at each other's throats there, weren't we? Yeah. It was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. So I hope you've really enjoyed it, folks. We've thoroughly enjoyed it. Don't forget our videos are absolutely free to subscribe to on YouTube. If you click the notification bell, you will get all our videos as we upload them. And a thumbs up. Go on, Dave. Thanks. What's this? Wiggle, wiggle the foot. Hello. Like wackaday, isn't it? What's Hello. That wackaday? Hello. Hello, wiggling my thumbs. Wackaday, what? Oh, I don't. And a thumbs up would be very, very nice, it wouldn't would it? Be. Yeah. So it thumbs down it, you know what I mean? I, I, I hate the haters. Well, I just, listen, you always get thumbs down, don't you? But that doesn't bother me. So long as you folks enjoy our videos, we shall keep producing them. So thanks for watching, and until next time, we shall see you on the bank, wherever. Keep on bagging and fish on. Five. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Dave. All right, Dave.